Tifa and I. She's like, you took 20 seconds to answer that. <laughs> you're just you're just staring at the wall for, <laughs> for a while. Welcome to the Josh and Adam show. This time we're playing Final Fantasy. Welcome back to the Josh and Adam show. Welcome back, everybody. Yeah, so we're starting a new series today. Final Fantasy VII Remake. Uh, this was released um, in 2020. The original Final Fantasy VII was one of the first games that I really loved, and it, it made me love gaming. Nice. So it was so cool when I found out that they were going to be doing a remake of it. And uh, I've, play, I've played the remake as well. It's very fun. Adam, this will be your first time playing through it and seeing oh, it. Oh, yeah. So I'm excited. Uh, I'm excited to show you the game, and I'm excited to play it for our show. So let's get to it good because i don't want to do the original <laughs> <laughs> well the original is a great game i mean it really uh i'll just go through some of these there we go yeah the original is a great game um but yeah it's it's dated it's a very old game and mm -hmm. it's great to see it you know with kind of a new coat of paint on it This feels like a very fleshed out, well-realized world uh, that, that takes place in. I give the game a lot of credit for that. I'm just like jokingly trying to picture all this in 8-bit happening. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it had, you know, some very good early FMV scenes, uh, cutscenes. Hmm. Uh, there was no voice acting at the time. Yeah, they probably couldn't even fit that kind of stuff. Right. Onto the memory. I don't think I don't think there was a voice acted Final Fantasy until Final Fantasy X. Hmm. I think it was the first one. I think that was the first Final Fantasy I was ever exposed to, even though I didn't play it. Mm -hmm. But I played it mm -hmm. at a friend's house, and I just remember thinking, these graphics are insane. Yeah. Well, <clears throat> Final Fantasy has always been at the cutting edge of, of um, like technical like technical video game development and visuals and stuff i mean that looks incredible right there <clears throat> yeah this is a major character we'll meet her later it's going to be everything you know that I, that I it's going to take everything that i have to just hold back from explaining every little detail of the <clears throat> the story <laughs> and the characters and the lore to you but we'll try to just let it play out i'm sure i'm gonna <clears throat> I'm going to go off on some kind of tangent at some point. He knocked down her flowers. What a dick. Curse you, boot man! <laughs> Damn, what a shot. Yeah, it's great. There's helicopters in this game? <clears throat> oh, yeah. Yeah, I really love the sort of industrial setting, I guess, 
Mm -hmm. It's not quite steampunk. Yeah. But it's close, you know. Here we are. There's a shot of a train as it goes into one of these reactors, and our hero just like a badass, just riding right on top. <laughs> And I pretty much just know him from Smash. Right, yeah. Myself. Cloud but is... But I do know he's from these games. Yeah. Cl Cloud is a big enough character to where he's sort of broken out into the wider video game, uh, you know, consciousness mm -hmm. uh, in the culture, I guess. This is the man right here. Get down here, Merc. This is Barrett. Barrett, I think, really benefited a lot from the touch-up of this game. He's a much more interesting character in this version of the game. Hmm. Here we go. How? Who goes there? Classic. Classic <laughs> security guard lines. Yeah. They nailed that. That's, that's Shakespearean. Yeah. Okay, so square to attack with Cloud Sword. Hold square to unleash an attack capable of hitting multiple nearby enemies. There are, in fact, You're multiple enemies us. nearby. I yeah. don't think so. So, so that's like an AoE attack. There we go. Nice. Guys, we got a trophy. <laughs> We're off to Who a good start. Hell? Hands where I can see them. Okay, so yeah, the ATV gauge fills as time passes and by attacking. Once it's full, you can perform special actions. Freeze! Move and we shoot! Go ahead. Oh, what? I keep of this. pressing the wrong button to get out of that <laughs> tutorial. <laughs> So yeah, you can <clears throat> hit X to pause, or it kind of slows down time, and you can yeah. select an ability to use. Oh, that's cool. Oh, I was a little too far away. Okay, so that's kind of like Cloud's moves in Smash, too, as far as like mm -hmm. the different abilities that's his sword cool. had. Yeah. So yeah, from the command menu. Okay. Yeah. You can... Yeah, so the command, you, command menu, you've got your sword attacks. You can also have spells that you can equip and items. I thought that last tutorial was like how to go through a turnstile. <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> yeah, so there's a lot of environmental uh, interactions in the game that are automatic. They just happen automatically. Okay, you can defend or evade. You're coming with so if us. I just block, Try it'll do less damage. Nice. I don't have a full ATV bar yet. He's pressured. So here we can go to Braver. We can select a target. And he'll just carry it out as soon as we select it. Okay, got chests. Nice. Two potions. I Here was hoping go. for two potions. Maybe three potions. No, no, two no, grenades. no. Oh, we're getting grenades now. That's way better than what I asked for. Uh, yeah. So these boxes, if you see them, you can get items from them. They'll also restore your your uh, MP nice. if you're casting spells and stuff. Oh, we just got through with Ratchet and Clank, so I know all about boxes. <laughs> yeah, baby. yeah, yeah. That's definitely a big part of this game as well. Soldier boy steel. Is he one of us now? He's got balls. This, uh, uh, what was his name again? Cloud. Cloud. Strike. Soldier boy, tell him. And he isn't a soldier anymore. <laughs> Still, he's a professional, unlike the rest of us. I'm glad to have him. 
This is a one-time gig. <laughs> <laughs> when it's done, we're done. These characters, by the way, just you'll love all of them. They're all great characters. <laughs> Every single one of them is great. I already like this guy. Yeah, he's awesome. Biggs, is that his name? Or Wedge. Oh, Wedge, Wedge, yeah. okay. And this one's Biggs right here. Ah, okay. So Biggs and Wedge, there's a lot of history with these guys. There's a Biggs and a Wedge in almost every iteration of the main series. It's just like, these are just, they're not even the same character. They're just names. Hmm. Um, they get reused a lot. Uh, Sid is another one that is in Final Fantasy VII, not in the remake. It's not in this part of the game. Uh, Sid is another character that's just in almost every single mainline Final Fantasy game. Hmm. Come on, nobody do something this crazy just for money. They may not think you're a true believer, but you know what I think? Not interested. What? Wedge. You better be worth the money, Merc. Every last gill. If my sweet shoulder plate armor has anything to say about it. <laughs> He's got a sweet little getup, doesn't he? Yeah. <clears throat> Yeah, the, the sword, I think, is the most iconic part of his look. And, and his spiky hair, too. That's He's sort of well-known for both of those things. I do remember as a kid, like, uh, just from other kids in school, seeing uh, either it was like, you know, I don't know, some sort of, like, gaming magazine or just pictures or something like that, but of that sword and being like, man, I wonder what game that is from. Yeah. So you can stagger enemies by building up that orange like, combo meter underneath their health. And they take bonus damage when they're staggered. Yeah, that freaking guard dog panther was insane. <laughs> yeah. What's this time? Ooh. Ether. What did he do? <laughs> Another dog with his tail on his head instead. <laughs> I just want someone to come around the corner and be like, he's beating the shit out of that dog. <laughs> yeah, somebody stop him. <laughs> That's animal cruelty. <laughs> I haven't played this game in months. Uh, you know, I, I played it when it first came out and, and pretty much just played right through it and beat it. Uh, and haven't really played it a whole lot since. Hmm. So I may be a little rusty relearning some of the stuff, but um, yeah, this is, I'm, this is great. I'm just right back in the same sort of mental place I was at when it came out. <laughs> just giddy, you know, this is such a great game. Oh, should, and now you get to do the PlayStation 5 version. I was going to say, yeah. So I should say, this is the integrated version. Um, so yeah, this is the PS5 version. It has better graphics. It has improved load times. Some DLC, which we may get to. Dogs with tails on their heads. <laughs> That's a big plus, for, in, in my opinion. Yeah, It wasn't in the PS4 version. Go look. <laughs> Staggered. Staggered. See ya. So what are these guys the security officer of? That's a good question. So I, I like again, I, I didn't want to just sort of just explain okay. to you everything that was I'm going asking on. Asking too much too early. No, 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 not at all. I just, I just didn't want to like lay it all out on you all at once. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So this I just is, didn't know if I should know already, like with this story that's been told. You know, this so that's far. an interesting point because it's hard for me to gauge that because like I knew I played this game when I was a kid. I knew everything going in already. Ah, so yeah, yeah. I don't know what like you're really expected to know as someone brand new to the game. Yeah. 
Um, but yeah, so we are playing as like basically eco terrorists. Okay. The the people that you've seen so far, Biggs and Wedge and Jesse and Barrett and all them. Yeah. They've hired Cloud, who is an ex soldier. Mm -hmm. So he's ex Shinra military. A, a soldier is like the elite uh, military force in the Shinra military. Okay. Um, so he's he's he used to belong to them. He's a mercenary now, and they've hired him to break into this uh, power plant. So this is an extraction plant, and they extract the natural resources of the planet. I won't go into too much detail. Okay. Um, it's called the life stream, and they convert it into electricity. And mm -hmm. and basically, Shinra's ability to extract this life stream has given this given them so this sort of like hegemonic control well, over society. Bet you see the few reactors. Yeah, so this is a, a, a so Mako is the name of the, 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 the energy they produce. Hmm. Ain't holding out on me, are you? Stamp scared to bite the hand that fed him? Or is he a loyal little doggy? <clears throat> Have it your way, mutt. We can do this with you, or we can do this without you. Different reactor, different layout. Depends when it was built. Never seen one like this. But I'll manage. Boy, we're already in turmoil. <laughs> well, of course, Barrett doesn't trust him because he doesn't like Shinra, and he knows Cloud is ex-Shinra. Uh. Don't you worry. Biggs will have the door open soon. You'll find out why they hired him anyway a little bit later. Three, two... Damn, I'm good. Answer, big sword. <laughs> Pretty much. I mean, that's a big part of it. <laughs> They wanted some, they wanted a heavy hitter. They wanted to bring a heavy hitter, you know. It's over. That's my line. Okay, yeah. So he's got a different mode he can enter, Punisher mode. So he walks slower, uh, but his square combo is a stronger uh, attack. Damn, looks like it. Yeah. And if you guard against an enemy attack, he'll counter. Ooh. Uh, let's see. I think if you if you evade out of it, we can take it. it'll reset back to operator mode. Uh, operator mode is like the normal mode. So he's, he holds the sword like this. Nice. <laughs> Officer D. <laughs> So we're gonna go ahead and pop a potion. We have plenty. And we're at half health. Popping potions. So you can you can pop items out of combat and it doesn't cost you anything except the item. It's a good thing In combat, I would have to spend ATB to, to use an item. Hmm. Pity no one else at command will talk to us, but what can you do? Huh. And we're good. Careful in there. <laughs> I got this place covered. Yeah. What's in here? Phoenix down. Ooh, a tuft. <laughs> so a phoenix, phoenix down is like a feather from a phoenix, obviously, uh, but it revives people like a <laughs> phoenix. Yeah. So you know Tifa, right? It's not really my business, but are you guys close? Tifa sounds like a setup, like put your teeth on these nuts or something. <laughs> yeah. Are you a friend of D's? Cloud! <laughs> Are you ignoring me? Tifa and I. She's like, you took 20 seconds to answer that. <laughs> you're just you're just staring at the wall for <laughs> for a while. Cool room. Mm. These sewer rats appear to call themselves Avalanche, sir. We are currently investigating whether they belong to the same group that made the attempt on your life. 
Rest assured, our inquiries will not take much longer. <laughs> this pump's sole purpose is to drain the planet dry. While you sleep, while you eat, while you sit, it's here sucking up, Marco. It doesn't rest, and it doesn't care. You do realize what Marco is, don't you? Marco <clears throat> is the lifeblood of our world. The planet bleeds green like you and me bleed red. The hell you think's gonna happen when it's all gone, huh? Answer me! You gonna stand there and pretend you can't hear the planet crying out in pain? I know you can! You really hear that? Damn straight I do! Yeah, so there's some pretty yeah. on-the-nose, you know, environmentalist <laughs> messaging. Like, you know, pretty too. radical. And this was all in the original game in the mid 90s when it came out. I oh, wow, yeah. Yeah, so. About the next five seconds. You know, very prescient. Very. It's interesting. Taking Captain Planet real seriously. <laughs> I mean, these are unambiguously uh, eco terrorists, yeah. and they're the good guys. Our lives are on the line now. And there's a very obvious, you know parallel with the real world Merc. one false move and that happens well so much for having cloud do all the fighting there are some places a sword just can't reach like my heart <laughs> oh pretty much she gets very horny for cloud in this game <laughs> yeah. should have asked for more money <laughs> yeah so he's childhood friends with tifa who is another member of avalanche that they're they're eco-terrorist group and she asked him to come to go with them on their mission so now we got a second Join party, the party. yeah so barrett does ranged attacks you can hold it Gonna down throw your sword at him. That's the man with the gun good work these tin cans ain't got nothing on me. Locked up. Dang. Yeah, so he, his triangle ability is the charge, overcharge. So you got like a big burst fire, and then it has to go on cooldown. So you can see the meter kind of charging up. You can hit triangle again, and he'll... You know, he'll do a little reload and it'll fill it up faster. Yeah, I think there's a way to like cancel out this like, you see that little cooldown period where he's reloading? Yeah. If, if you do that into the charge ability, I think it, you can do it for free, kind of. I'll show you what I mean. Uh, yeah, so you can switch characters at any time in battle. And you can also, in the ATB meter, you can issue commands to people you're not controlling. Oh, that's cool. So like from here, I can, I've got Barret, so I can hit R2 and it'll switch to Cloud. And I can have him do one of his abilities. Yeah. So it gives you pretty good control over all of the members of your party. But yeah, so if I, if I hold it down, and it goes to the recharge, I can hit the triangle and it does it pretty much seamlessly. So it allows you to build your, your meter a lot faster. That was, a, that was a, a trick that I learned on my original playthrough of the game. It makes him do a lot more damage. Look what we have here. A laser security system. Great. Those things will hurt more than your pride if you're careless. They'll cut you down to size and then some. But I'm guessing you've done this So we got some more. Before. Yeah. Dipping beneath the lasers, Adam. Catherine Zeta Jones. <laughs> this is a pretty common theme in our games that we play. <laughs> There's lots of lasers in games. That's true. That's true. But not enough Catherine Zeta Jones, you know? <laughs> not in games, at least. No. Hmm. You can hold R1 to dash. Yeah. Nice. He's a natural. He <laughs> waited till it turned off. Yeah. Oh, that's funny. You can't dodge if you're not in combat. Oh. I was trying to dodge across it, and that doesn't work. I didn't remember that. It's not like a literal dash, I guess. Yeah. Come on, 
Yeah, it's a pretty shitty security system. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I think he'll just walk right into it. Oh, no, no, he, he waited. Okay. I thought he would. Two more potions. I like the cable management on the floor. It's nice. <laughs> yeah. It's a very clean facility. Good running know. mats. Okay. So this is like a little mini boss here. That hunk of junk is a heavy weapons platform. If we rush Sweeper. in, we die. Is that right? We need to hit it with magic. That should give us an opening. Kind of looks like a train car on the front. <laughs> yeah. I love the, the the design of the different robots and stuff. Oh, I love his big shoes. Ooh. Okay, yeah. So if you if you knock them off balance, they'll be pressured, which means their stagger gauge fills up faster. Hey, it's not moving. Let's put it down. Give it all you've got. Well, we'll do a focus thrust. Stagger. Okay. So their defenseless take more damage. Um, using unique abilities on a stagger foe will quickly boost your ATB gauge. Now's our chance. Go. So let's uh, use thunder. Oh. Um, let's use focus shot. Ah, <laughs> oh, his little shoes. They're like the cow pushers. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Yeah. <laughs> I am infinite. <laughs> There's some goofy dialogue in this game. Barrett is very funny. He's he's really honestly a great character. I really like uh, Barrett a lot in the way they they handled him in the remake. What happened to the other dude that was with us? That's our target. The uh, they core. got split up somehow. Gotta I don't remember. The at the okay. bottom. Let's get down there. Yeah, they're. I think they're doing something else. Oh yeah. Let's see. Don't want to miss any goodies. Okay. There's a goodie. Scared, huh? God, I love the I love the music in this game so much. Yeah, it's really nice. Yeah, it just it just brings me back to my childhood. I just there's, there's just so much nostalgia for this game. Oh, well, I, there might have been a chest over there, Jesse. <laughs> God damn, give me a break. Hassling you for exploring. <laughs> These freaking things. What are those? Yeah, like little, little scouting drones. Yeah. Oh. I don't think you liked it at all. <laughs> Yeah, I I really love the uh, the combat system in this game. It's it's so different than the original, of course. Um, it's like much more action oriented, but I thought they did a really good job with it. Uh, yeah, like what? How, how did this compare to the original as far as like this sort of combat here? So the original is way more um, kind of like turn based. Mm -hmm. You do have like an ATB meter, uh, but it just kind of fills up on its own, and when it when it maxes out, you get to take an action. That means it's your turn. And enemies have a, a hidden ATV meter, and they do the same thing. Whenever theirs fills up, they take an action. Okay. So not like truly turn-based, but but a lot more than this. You didn't control the movement or attacks of your characters or whatever. You just yeah. you just selected an action, whatever it was, uh, whenever it was their turn, basically. Um, so of course they did a lot to update it, and they've done a lot to update the whole series. is more action oriented nowadays. 
All right. Let's see if Little Stamp really can bite the hand that feeds. Hmm. Go on. Do the honors. Prove to me you're the man Tifa says you are. That you're one of us. Never said I was. I'm just here for the paycheck. Then do the damn job! My memories! <laughs> A toad. Yeah, there is something out of place with Cloud's memories. What's wrong? I'm fine. What about the timer? You'll call, Merc. I don't think it ends up mattering. Huh. That long enough for you? Y yes. <laughs> <laughs> you double crossing! Heads up! What in the hell? Oh, damn. Hey, how the hell do we fight this thing? It's got reinforced armor plating, but the internals can be overloaded. Lightning magic. Huh. No other option, huh? That's just what I thought, lightning magic. I'm waiting. Whatever. <laughs> we barely scratched the damn thing. Didn't I tell you to use magic? Thought you <laughs> Whatever you want, just do it. <laughs> there you go. Thunder. You see the Keep it up. <laughs> there we go. Death grip. Okay, he's about to use an attack that cannot be guarded against. The exclamation point symbol will appear. Take evasive action. Oh, I tried to dodge that one. Okay. So he's bound. Quickly switch to a different character. Got anything Fair enough. To say? So I can... Funny way to ask for help. I, can, I have a two ATB, so I can cure him. Just gonna heal him. I wasn't expecting you to do Jack. Let's do this. Okay, let's do one of these. Yeah, so does Cloud have magic or is that just Barret? He does, yeah. So magic um, is equipped on characters with materia, but we haven't I don't we haven't I've gotten to the part, part of the game where you can actually change your materia. Oh, okay. Never seen this defense system before. Not you were the expert. So what's your brilliant plan, genius? It's my time to shine. <laughs> or go down in flames. Oh, damn it! This thing is tough! It wouldn't be much of a weapon if it went down easy. Don't compliment the giant scorpion! Ooh, wait the spot. If we don't change oh, yeah. it soon, this thing's gonna kill us both! Less talking, more shooting. How about less lift from you? Still him. These guys are excellent at having conversation under pressure. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? No, he didn't die, did he? No, okay. He's got him a potion on himself. Hey, you good? Real good. I'm trying to kill this new generator. Yeah, it's immune to... It didn't hmm. work. Maybe Cobb would be better at it. Oh, okay. Give it everything you've got. What spells does Cloud have? Okay, he just has fire. Fire! Ooh. Gotta heal up. Deal with that. Yes, it's my turn. 
Wow, I only have seven MP left with Barret. Let's go ahead and get a cure. I can use an Ether on him. Oh, so I can't walk onto his weak spot. Ooh. Whoa, God, I guess the, the edge there. There we go, okay. I oh, can't hit him. The cloud up there. It's butthole is the weak point. <laughs> Pretty much, yeah. <laughs> Just dark soulsing the guy, you know, you just run around to the back of him. And hit him <laughs> yeah, pretty much. And, and dodge roll out of the way. Yeah. <laughs> got him at like halfway. Yeah. <laughs> nice. Oh god. <laughs> yes, now he starts dropping debris on the on the ground. Oh shit. Watch the tail. You don't want to be hit by that laser. Huh? So what do we do? Don't get hit. Take cover behind that debris. Need my help, do you? Mm -hmm. Do you want to use a potion? That was my limit gauge. It's like a special attack. Works on him a little bit. Gotta memorize the attack patterns. Keep it together. <laughs> it's like very motivational while you fight. <laughs> it was. Keep it together. Gotta learn these attack patterns. Again and again and again. Okay, can cast cure on cloud. We'll just stay, I think, behind there. Now, get in there and do some damage. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Let's see, what does Steel Scan do? Temporarily reduce damage taken and how easily you're going to do it. That's pretty hard. Yeah, later we can put shortcuts on abilities um, and be able to use them without going into the menu every time. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, so it, it gets a lot better. Maybe they have them, they have them set already by default. I don't remember. We can take a look at it later, though. An auto repair unit. Damn it. We gotta take it out quicker with the Oh. Oh, I am way ahead of you, Murphy. We gotta time our attacks just right. Hold out until you spot an opening. What other different targets are there? Okay, just the left leg and right leg. Oh, okay, yeah. Almost got 
that left leg. Yeah. Hey, you still women? Here we go. Ready when you are. Thunder. Nice. Got him. Nice. Oh, second wind. Yeah, this is supposed to be like a guard robot. And it's like just blowing everything up. <laughs> huh, you hear that? Damn thing showed you how it's done. Come on, we've got to move. When should be covering our way out? Go, go, go. Okay, the timer. I don't. I didn't remember that. The timer didn't start until after we were done. I was gonna say, I was like, why did the timer just start then? Yeah. Like, did they activate it after that, or? I think so. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I was gonna say, good thing that fight wasn't a half hour. <laughs> it is a long fight. <laughs> the original fight against the guard scorpion is just very short, little simple, um, like tutorial battle. We got four gill. Climbing up the ladder. Da, da, da. Da, 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 da. Okay, great soundtrack in this game. So good. Whoa. Things got way hairier really quick. <laughs> yeah. On fire part? <laughs> Come this way. Well, not literally right there. <laughs> I think I see an exit. Come on. Woo. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go, let's go. Oh, there's a chest. I got two potions. Yeah, I want those potions. Shut up and climb. Shut up and climb. It keeps me focused. I'll freak out if I don't talk. Have it your way. There's Barrett. Oh yeah, he can't climb with the gun hand. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's pretty quick for a one-handed going up a ladder. Oh yeah. He's got a lot of upper body strength. Look at him. Yeah, right. I mean, he's built. I've got you covered. Find us a way out of here. But then... Don't worry, I'll be fine. I've got Soldier Boy with me. X, Soldier Boy. They're here. Take them down. We don't have time for this shit. The clock ticking. Cool it. Five seconds is all we need. What's that? <laughs> All right, like a little bit longer than that, but you know. Okay, yeah, so I do have the shortcut set. <laughs> yeah, so if you hold down L1, it'll bring up a little shortcut menu, and then you can uh, just press one of the face buttons for, nice. for a special ability. Train boots. Shoot me. Oh. Weird. There you go. It was like the motion of the guns, but yeah. it wasn't shooting. Try this. Let's do it. Don't stop now. That thing looks so top heavy. 
<laughs> yeah. Doesn't look very stable, does it? Even with those ginormous shoes. Gonna make your eyeballs pop. <laughs> I mean, the detail on everything is insane. Yeah, I mean, it, it looks so good. It does. I mean, this is even better than I remember it looking on the PS4, obviously, you know. It looks incredible. Bottle of ether. Mono drives. Enemies are super easy to kill. I do remember there being some pretty tough enemies. Oh yeah, these shot troopers, okay. They like dodge your attacks a lot. It's at level eight. Obviously. Any time now. So, are those things just robots, or are those people like with robot appendages? Um, for these, that's a good question. These look like uh, maybe people to me. Keep it together. I don't know. I'm just too close there. Yeah. Ooh. Oh. Yeah. They yeah, just sang the thing there. <laughs> yeah, that's great. Nice. I don't know down quick. <laughs> Classic. <laughs> Sir. That dude looks like a sea captain. Yeah. With that sweet ass phone. Destroy the evidence. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so he had his own robots go in and destroy the, the reactor. The bomb didn't do it. Didn't do enough damage. Hmm. Come on, come on, come on, come on. <clears throat> so they destroyed their own reactor. Narcolepsy. <laughs> yeah, this would not be a good time to be asleep. <laughs> It's just to show how just like of a, you know, calm badass he is. Yeah. I'm zen as fuck, bro. <laughs> Pretty much. I think in the original game, Cloud came off as a little on the, uh, I guess, angsty side. I thought they did a pretty good job with the remake of like making him a little cooler. Hmm. He's still a little on the, he's still a little angsty, but, you know, he just, I don't know, he just seems more realistic to me. Yeah. Not, not quite as annoying. Oh! Whoa, okay, all right. He can do sweet jumps. Yeah, he can. Yeah, he can walk the walk for sure.
Well, everybody's dead who sees this. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it, was the, it was powered by the Ark of the Covenant. Yeah. <laughs> One time gig. Looks like we made it. That was the whole first chapter of the game. Looks like we made it. <laughs> Think you might have overdone it. I follow the instructions. This chicken's the dry. Maybe it triggered a reaction with the Mako? Well, let's hope the city's still in one piece. But the plan is what matters, right? I mean. This must have helped some. After all that, it had better have. Anyway, let's get going. It had better have. What a <laughs> what a horribly what a horrible grammatical sentence there. <laughs> you got it. Huh. That, that may be correct, but uh, it just there's definitely a better way you could have said that. <laughs> I don't want to walk into those. Can't wait to get out in the open. Man, what is that? I've never smelled anything so foul. Oh, it's me. Gotta do something about that. <laughs> I felt that one in my guts. You just keep on coming. We need to get out of this place. Was it the Mako density? The primary explosive? The blasting agent? Hey, we can figure that out later. <sighs> I'm running on empty here. You can refuel at the base. Next time I'll have to bring a little pick me up. How it doesn't help do when someone's go? running on empty. Yeah. Two potions. That's about as good a place as any. Stand back then. I'll set the bomb. Can't wait to see you, Marlene. Can't wait to take a hot shower. What are they blowing up? She's good to go. You know, they don't have the keys to the place. Let <laughs> me get a little bit further around the side of the wall. I'll put a bomb at you. Attention, all citizens. Attention, all citizens. This is an alert from the Shinra Emergency Operations Center. Unidentified intruders have detonated a bomb inside Mako Reactor 1. Multiple explosions have been confirmed, as well as ongoing fire. In response, a disaster warning has been issued. <laughs> Jenny's worried about the warning. Mm -hmm. Stop now. This was just the first reactor, and the planet won't be safe till we get the rest. Yeah, we always knew this was gonna get messy. And this is only the beginning. Y'all gotta look at the bigger picture here. Nothing worth fighting for was ever won without sacrifice. Though you may not be crying out, I know you're in pain, just like the planet. But it's okay, cause I'm here for you to help take the load off your shoulders. Your fears, your worries, your concerns, and yes, your feelings. Whatever your problem, I got you. <laughs> like, wouldn't you run through a brick wall for a guy like that? Dude, right? <laughs> I love, I love Baron in this game so much. I will kill this planet to save this planet. <laughs> I will kill every person on this planet <laughs> to save the planet. <laughs> All right.
right. I think Go. that's a that's a good stopping spot right there. Yeah. Um. But yeah. So uh, what did you what did you think, Adam? I like it. I dig it. Yeah. It's it's really really good. This is just the beginning. Yeah. I guess we'll stop it right there. Thank you for watching. Remember to uh, like this video and subscribe if you feel so inclined. And uh, catch us on the next one. We'll see you on the next one. <laughs> I just want someone to come around the corner and be like, he's beating the shit out of that dog. <laughs> Somebody stop him. <laughs>